Magandang araw po sa inyong lahat at sa araw na ito po ay tayo po ay magbabalik tanaw doon sa biyahe ni Padre papunta sa Holy Land. At yan ang ating tampok ngayon sa ating buhay parokyano. So sa bago pa po sa channel na ito, please po hit sa subscribe button at ang notification bell para maging updated po kayo po video na ilalabas namin sa channel na ito. So Hindi ko na po masyadong patagalin, simulan na po natin. Mga kapatid, magandang araw po at <laughs> ready na po tayo. for Holy Land. Uh, Patid, magandang araw po. No. Magsimula ngayon, um, biyahe namin sa Holy Land. Andito na po yung bagay ko. No, di, yun, di, uh, first Holy Land. So, sama -sa samahan niyo po kami ngayong araw na ito. Noy! Mabahiga, ano ka nakagpa sa lubong, ha? Ha? Ang binutan ka din niya. Mm. Ang binutan ka din niya. Bye bye. Dito na kami sa airport. Sama ko si Daddy Andrew. Ah, si Papa na si Ingat. Si Mama. At si Emil. Ang huli na daw mapil ng gatas. Vanilla Pads. Oh, Pablo International Airport. Tod na ko sa airport. Asi sister, oh, sister. Brother Paul and Bukno. Oh, Brother Paul and Buknoy <laughs> Okay oh. Ah, si Father Lel, Father Edo Oh, give him this Oh, oh. Yeah. Ano, miss, ha? US, si Father Oh, Korean, Korean Oh, kami, Father Lel, has to sa German <laughs> 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 First day sa Udong Holy Land. Si Mayor ba nga? Mau. Mau. First day sa Holy Land. Then si BM at si Superman. Okay. We keep you in the fires. Ah, Reyes. Ito na kami sa Naiya At si Brother Paul kasama natin Ah! Si Bruno Mars? Ah! Bilin? Oh! Si Ati Mile Wow!
Miss Casino. Miss Casino. Wonderful. Kapatid, oh. Ang ganda sa mall na ito. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. 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 Oh, Miss Lila. <laughs> Miss Taguilara. <laughs> wow. This is the mall. Nari pantat dari sa pantat. Makan pas sabal ya, senyap senyap. lahat. Dan di sini kita di Grand Rainbow Hotel di Manila. At kasama natin si Brother Paul Alima Dito si Brother Paul Brother Paul Say hi Brother Paul Hello Brother yeah. Paul The place Kasama natin okay. Maraming salamat At Samahan niyo kami sa Keyword A pilgrimage Doon sa Holy Land O oh, ayan, so si na Padre is uh, nakabiyahe na from Tagbilaran to Manila and now, papunta na sila ngayon sa Qatar. Ba? Ganda talaga mag, ano, no, mag uh, sana soon makasali tayo sa <laughs> pilgrimage para <laughs> ganun din, makapag-documentary rin tayo, ano? So, uh, ito tayo ngayon si Father Darwin uh, from Philippines to Qatar. Kasama niya ang buong katropa niya doon sa pilgrimage. So, tingnan natin kung anong mga nangyari sa kanilang trip doon sa Qatar. Dubai, it's your mom, Albert Paul. Oh, Duha Katar, eh? Hey, you're in Duha Katar. Yes, sir. Nay, you're not in Duha Katar? Nay, you're not Okay, nice. Nay, I'm in Karon. Nay, you're not in Duha Katar. Ito yung mga sama natin sa Holy Land. Okay. Hey. Oh, hello. Oh, sama natin sa Holy Land. Okay. Hello. Hello. Hi, Father. Hi, Father. Hi, Hello. Hi, Hello. 
kemarin saya tengok. Kemarin saya. Hello, Teh. Oh. Hi. Hello. Good morning. Yes, Janus. So, yun mga kasama natin. Ang dami namin pagpunta sa Holy Land. sa Jordan Aman O ayan So based na nakikita po ninyo Basta kaya na sila ng aeroplano Pagpunta doon sa kanila pupuntahan At sa tingin ko Talagang malayo yung biyahin yun At nakapagod talaga Eh nung dati umalis kami ni Pare Darwin Ano natulog siya Bago pa lumipat ng aeroplano Daya naman ako. Ako, enjoy na enjoy ako doon sa, ano, sa biyahe. Ito, mas mahabang biyahe to dahil uh, sa ibang bansa ito eh. Pero ganun aman, continue po tayo sa, sa ating panunurin na kanyang adventure doon patungo sa Holy Land. Sama namin <laughs> With Brother Paul Good morning Nandito na kami sa Aman Sure dan At nandito ang Mount Nebo Brother uh, Paul Yung Mount Nebo Ay lugar yun kung saan pinakita bundok kung saan pinakita Moses. ni Moses ang uh, promised land uh, very biblical itong pilgrimage may ano natin. pa doon pa doon? may simbahan pa doon? may simbahan at ipakilala natin anong simbahan ang katayo doon uh, excited tayo anong simbahan ang baka uh, uh, mga kapatid natin uh, ano nandun tingnan natin ha? Sa? Oh! <laughs> Di, ano? Dito siguro tayo. So, papunta na kami sa bus namin. So, ang ganda dito. Deserto po ito. Oh, Deserto po ito. So, 
Oh, dito si Papa Nusing. So, ano naramdaman mo ngayon, pa? First time mo nakalabas sa bansa. Anong naramdaman mo ngayon? Nakatulog ka ba ng mahimbing? Wala. Wala? Nakatulog? Tulog ka lang sa bus ngayon. Oh, bus tayo. To Amar. Ikaw? Ah, si Kantay Parata. Smile. Kaya namin sa... Dito na kami sa Aman, Jordan Going to Mount Nebo So ang dami ni namin mga kapatid Mabot kami na Ang ginaw Grabe Ito na yung Sasakyan namin Ito na yung sasakyan namin sasakyan natin mga kapatid ito lang mga kisamahan natin oo okay ang dun daw ito ito mga kisamahan natin ito mga kisamahan Parang nasa loob kami sa refrigerator. Nasa loob ng freezer, oh. Ang ginaw. Mount Nebo. Diyan ininibing si Moses sa Mount Nebo. Pinakita niya yung promise na kanaan City of Jericho. Asa daw? Asa man dito ka na? It's now the Church of St. George, Greek Orthodox. We have the Madonna paintings here. The Madonna. A lot of mosaic paintings. Feature of Saint of Perpetual Health. A lot of saints, great saints. This is a great Orthodox church. So 
of St. George. Amazing. Music from Sir Rolanda. Yeah. Look at the decoration, a lot of paintings, even to the Greek Orthodox Church. St. George's Church, owned by Greek Orthodox. This is Hi, guys. Do you have a cat? Again, again, in Madaba, in Madaba, we have more than 14 churches. The most important one is the one outside, the Greek office of St. George. When you later on, when you go inside, you will see on the floor, you will see this map. Right? The map of the Holy Land from 6th century AD. Now, it's a biblical map, not geographic map. So, it has different directions. Here we have north. South, yeah. East, and West. Oh. You have to look like this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now this map, you know, used to be bigger than this. It used to be 15 meters and 5 meters. Nowadays, inside we can see 3 to 4 meters only. Because of what? The people long time ago, they used to sit on it. And because of the earthquake. Especially the one we had here, yeah, called Gadi earthquake. 749 AD. So a large part of Jordan, north and the middle of Jordan, destroyed by Galilee, 7498. Now here, yeah, for example here should be Red Sea. Red Sea. Here should be the city of Galilee. So again, a large part of this map is missing. Now, I want you to look at this. Number four and number three. Jordan River and Dead Sea, right? Both, again, are national borders. So this area we call Jordan Valley national border between Jordan and Israel. Now, here Israel on the west of it, Jordan on the east, right? Number three, we can see the Dead Sea, the lowest point on Earth, 400 meters below sea level. Even it's mentioned in the Bible as the Sea of Salt. Right? We can see two ports here, right? So at that time, they used to have ports to call up to carry the line of the soul from side to other. And also, we can see two fish, one going to the Dead Sea, the other one, we can't complete sea to whatever it means, but no life in this sense, right? Yes. Now, number five, you can see here, in this other part, is Jericho, right? The oldest city in the world, 10,000 years old. Now, the area between Jericho, between number five and number one, here, Jericho and Jerusalem, we call it the Judean Valley, where the Mount of Temptation is located at, where Jesus was tempted by the devil three times. Number six, we have Jacob's work, where Jesus drank water when he was on his way from the city of Galilee to the city of Jerusalem. Now, of course, the most important place of this map is <coughs> number one, <coughs> Jerusalem. Yes, we can see two important roads here. Look at this one. We call it the Calvary Maximus, was built by the Romans after 78, <coughs> after they destroyed Jerusalem. But also you can see, more important here, this is Via Dolorosa, mm -hmm. where Jesus carried the cross. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Number two, Bethlehem, right? Okay. Where Jesus was born. Another one also was born in Bethlehem. Uh, King David. Mm -hmm. King David also was born here in Bethlehem. Bethlehem. Right. We can see also. Okay. Now to the south, in the map here, we can see what? Egypt Park. Number eight mm -hmm. is. Mount Sinai, where Moses got the Ten Commandments and when he spoke to the God. And you know, Moses was the only prophet who spoke to the God directly with no angels. Right? Number nine, we can see what? Nine River, where the daughter of the power of Egypt found Moses when he was three months old. You know, when the power of Egypt had to kill all the Israelites, even the newborn Moses was only three months. So this month, Put him in a basket, in a knife. Yeah. 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 We are so found here. Now the importance of this map is it shows the Christian pilgrims where to start and where to finish. At the same time, it's connecting the Old Testament, right, with the New Testament. So Moses' time, we 
producer's part. Now, of course, the artist who made this map he was Fraga. He knows every single detail of the Fraga. And he used more than uh, 2 million pieces of color in the stores. Yes. Now, this map was discovered in 1895 by a Christian family came from the south of Jordan to the middle. From here, they came from Calak. So Calak was once a Christian town. So the family who discovered this map, they came from Calak in the south of Jordan to Madrid. Madrid is here, right? Also, we can see the Jordan side, number 11. It is like uh, around 15 kilometers to the south of this. Number 11 is what? Yeah, right. This is the place where Lot lived with his two daughters after Sodom and Gomorrah. Right here. And it was, you know, the Dead Sea. Right? Uh, do you have any questions? Anything? By the way, you can see here, look, this is the uh, Jerusalem. You can see the land. You can see Via de la Rosa. And you can see the Cardinal Seamus. Okay. We're going to St. George Church in Malaba City. So the Madaba Church of St. George is established during 2nd century, during Byzantine era. And there are a lot of uh, sculptures there by Mozart artists. This is it, the Church of St. George. No? There are only three churches here during Byzantine era. Many large churches were built in Madaba, including the Church of the Apostle, Church of Virgin Mary, and Church of St. George, also known as the Church of the Map. So this is the Church of Mandaba. Churches. Amazing. This is a... Father. Yes? I wanna check it. Let's gather here please, bus number one here. Example of mosaic art. Kita ninyo? So look at, this is a mosaic art. Mary Church. This is archaeological part of Madava Virgin Mary Church. Brother. Brother Gabriel. Brother Gabriel. The Virgin Mary Church is owned by the Roman Catholic. Yeah, it's actually have a lot of churches here. All owned by the Roman Catholic. But we're going to see the most important and beautiful one, which is St. George. It's like St. George. Saint George. Saint George. Yun, sarap talaga mag-bakasyon, ano, no? So, at, uh, by the way, mga uh, nanonood ngayon, no? So, yun po, ang um, nakita ni Father Darwin, yung Virgin Mary Church. Kaya tinanong niya yung, yung kanilang tour guide na si Brother Gabriel. Tinanong niya na uh, yung bang Virgin Mary Church sa, ano, sa, sa Holy Land, Uh, huli lang na ba yun? Oh. Basta doon sa pinuntahan nila Pagmamayari ba ng Roman Catholic Church? No? At ang sabi naman niya is Nasa ano sila uh, Yes Pagmamayari ng Roman Catholic Church Okay? So uh, Sa sunod na po nating labas Abangan na po natin ang, ang sunod na kabanata Ng kanilang pag uh, Pagtutur Doon sa lugar kung saan tinatawag na Holy Land no so abangan natin yon uh, magsasagawa pa ng marami pang ano si Brother Darwin doon maraming mga uh, ano ba tawag dito uh, pagdo-documentary sa mga lugar na kanya napuntahan at uh, kasama ang ating ang inyong lingkod Brother Jando Alabado eh sisikapin ko po na may paliwanag din po yung mga lugar na napuntahan ni Father Darwin Gitgano. So part 1 po lamang po muna ito. Part 1 po lamang muna. Abangan nyo po ang karugtong nito sa mga darating na araw. Okay? Part 1 po lang po muna tayo at mamaya, kita kiss tayo mamayang gabi sa ano ba yung uh, ano ngayon? Tuesday pa lang ngayon ano? Sa punto por punto doctrinal 
exposition. Paalam na po sa inyong lahat. Bye-bye!